Hey everyone, welcome to the session. I think I'm live. Let me just confirm, guys. Uh, yes, I can see myself on the screen. So that means definitely I'm live. Hey guys, all of you once again, welcome to the session. So this is how to improve your reading speed or how to be a good reader. Topic pe to baad mein aati hu, because this topic is the pain point for many of you. Pehle, let me just kind of run you through these important announcements. Sabse pehla, Cat Prodigy Scholarship Test. Prodigy. The name itself says you've got a chance to be become a prodigy. So make sure you enroll for this test. It's there on April 23rd. It's going to be from 3 p.m. to 4 p.m. 30 questions will be there. And you stand a chance to win rewards and scholarships if you do well. Moreover, up to 1,000 learners stand a chance to win up to 100% scholarship. So go for it. Do not miss it for the world. And yes, after that, I'll call you Prodigy. Okay, if you are a new learner and you are enrolling for the first time, you need to use a referral code. Use mine. That's given over there. Shabana Live, S-H-A-B-A-N-A-L-I-V-E. -A so this was the first and the most important announcement of the day. The second one, which is, I think, equally important, is something that benefits you. I mean, just in case you're thinking how to go about your preparation without a subscription, this is the time to take a subscription, guys. You need not think further. So this is an offer that's going on, a brilliant offer, a straight 20% off. So if you take a 12-month subscription, you end up paying 24,000 and for a 24 month ticket, it's only 32,000. Got it. So please take a subscription. And of course, for this also, you need to use my referral code Shabana Live. Bar bar kyun bol you Shabana Live? Because you need me for your VARC preparation. Just come over to the classroom once and see how well I'll be guiding you. I mean, ekdam hi structured tarikhe se organized way mein, we'll be doing your VARC. So don't think, don't wait further, just come. Hi, frustrated boy, good evening. Kyo rakha tha apne ID apna? Frustrated boy, why? What drove you to do that? Anyway, the third one is uh, the batch course that we started on March 30th. That's March to Success Batch. And in case you have not joined it, you can join the new one that's coming up on April 13th. Aaj kya hai? 11th hai, just day after tomorrow. So again, you'll use my referral code, Shabana Life, and enroll for these batches, guys. Okay, so I'm done with all the announcements. Now I'm taking you over to the topic for which we are sitting here today. That is reading. Give me a book and a secluded corner, a swimming pool or a stream nearby, so that I can hear the gushing sound of water. Stream may aega, swimming pool me to nii aega, gushing sound. And then I think I'll be very happy for the rest of the day. Why? Because reading happens to be my favorite, one of my favorite engagements. You know, when I'm totally stressed out, but whenever I feel fatigued, I put everything away. I take up a book and I start reading. I just lie down on the sofa, legs up, and I just read for a few a few minutes. Few minutes bolo to kitana hota hai. few minutes per 40 minutes at a stretch at least. Why do I do that? Because after that, my brain feels relaxed. Now that is because I'm used to this thing called reading. For those of you who are not used to reading, must be thinking, kya bakwas kar rahi hai? Reading? Oh please, utni dar mein to main jaake ice cream khake a jau. Or I can watch something on Netflix or Amazon. So yes, you can do that also. But then, Reading is the thing that will help you score home runs in your CAT, CAT VARC. That is why we are sitting here with the topic today, reading. All right. So I'll show you what in my opinion are the ACE points when it comes to reading. We all know in CAT you're going to get four passages. The four passages are going to be from different topics. Now, if you don't have familiarity with those topics, you will be totally lost as if in a maze, a labyrinth. You won't be able to find your footing around. 
ठीक है और इसमें क्या होगा कि एवरी अदर वर्ड विल बी अनफेमिलियर टू मी सो द थिंग इज दे विल बी अनफेमिलियरिटी एंड यू विल टेक अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम टू रीड एज अ रिजल्ट टाइम विल बी ओवर करने थे चार आर सी थर्टी मिनट्स में यू विल एंड अप डूइंग प्रॉबली वन एंड हाफ सो दैट इज द पॉइंट दैट आई एम ट्राइंग टू ड्राइव होम ओवर हियर बाई वे ऑफ दीज टाइम पॉइंटर्स पॉइंट नंबर वन इज रीड रेग्यूलरली If you think VARC is going to happen overnight, think twice. You have to read regularly. You have to build up because it's a language. Unlike QA, DILR, where you need to practice sets, you need to apply techniques, you need to apply the shortcuts and formulae. So this is totally different. I'm not saying that here we don't have techniques. We do have, but then those techniques are all useless if you don't have your regular reading skill. so if i say read regularly what do i mean i mean at least 30 to 40 minutes you should read daily now isme aap ek bahut mazedar point bhi hai i have read about this that reading somehow slows down your cognitive degeneration over the years so you must be thinking abhi to hum bahut young hai humko zarurat nahi hai but maybe you can keep this pearl of wisdom for the rest of your life when you start growing older you can keep reading as one of your favorite activities and remember my words it slows down cognitive degeneration i'm doing it for that okay so read regularly 30 to 40 minutes per day that is the minimum that i feel everybody should read and then what should you read don't read just for the heck of reading khol liya maine editorial ya khol liya maine opinion page ma'am ne bola padhna hai karke 40 minutes mein maine complete kar liya kuch samajh nahi aaya फिर भी कर तो लिया आज का मेरा रीडिंग का कोटा हो गया यू मे एज वेल नॉट रीड दैन ओके सो वेन आई से रीड रीड रेग्यूलरली आई मीन रीड प्रोडक्टिवली वट एवर यू आर रीडिंग फॉर दोज फोर्टी मिनट्स यू शुड बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड एवरीथिंग फाइन इफ यू वॉन्ट टू नो द रीडिंग सोर्सेस एंड द रीडिंग टॉपिक्स यू कैन जॉइन माई स्पेशल क्लास और क्लास इन दैट आई हैव गिवेन अ फुल लिस्ट ऑफ रीडिंग सोर्सेज एंड टॉपिक्स बेस्ड ऑन प्रीवियस ईयर कैट पैसेजेस ओके द नेक्स्ट वन 200 word per minute versus 400 many people have this dream i want to read 400 450 words per minute just like ace readers i don't strive for that theek hai hogi meri reading speed utni why because i have been reading for donkey's years but the thing is a reader who reads 400 words per minute and doesn't understand much is not better off than a reader who reads 200 words per minute but he is able to understand the key points and he walks away with the crux the gist of the passage so a smart reader is any day better organized reading is any day better so when i say organized reading when i say 200 words per minute bhi chalega provided you understand everything you understand like you know flow kya hai what do i mean by organized reading that is in the third grasp the main points so instead of reading everything word for word like this morning if you had done the editorial with me 11 am pe jo hum karte hain tts pe this morning we discussed um, what did we discuss it was uh, anti abortion laws heartbeat if you hear the heartbeats of the fetus you cannot abort it so this was the topic now i took it from uh, from a passage from an article that was there in scientific american and i took just the key paragraphs just the important paragraphs there were many other paragraphs and i just omitted those even when i was doing my reading for that particular pdf i just did not read every little point i went through it i picked the key points that i wanted what is he trying to say le kidhar ja raha hai flow kidhar hai iska theek hai and that is how i do my reading. so grasp the main points for a particular point if the author has given four examples it's not compulsory that you have to go through all four if you have understood what he is trying to say by way of just one or two that's good enough for you all right so that is point number 3 grasp the main points now i come over to point number 4 skim unnecessary portions so there are these unnecessary portions let's say there is some data let's say there are examples let's say one point has has been explained in a lot of detail let's say there are technical points why do you need to go into all those like in great detail you don't need to delve into the depths 
to actually understand. So when you are skimming, you just read the first two lines of every paragraph to understand what that paragraph is about. And then you skim. Skimming is vertical reading like this. So you check the key points, you connect them in your mind. Okay, this is what he's saying. And these paragraphs are connected with the main paragraph definitely. So this is called skim unnecessary portions. Then I come over to vocabulary. If you have got a massive vocabulary, something like maybe Shashi Tharoor, right? You can easily understand the text. It will give you speed. Why? Because whatever you're reading is familiar. So you don't need to pause and think twice about the words. You don't need to scratch your head. Got it? So the two cents over here is keep improving your vocabulary. It always pays to have a humongous vocab. All right. Okay, next one, familiarity. Now, what is familiarity? It's when you're reading a passage and you have read something about it earlier. Let's say it's that passage that we did this morning, uh, anti-abortion wala. Okay, uh, there, were, there were mentions over there about uh, Roe versus Wade. Okay, I had come across that long back in another RC passage and I remembered that. So this morning when I started reading this editorial, sorry, this article, I was able to connect very easily. So what I'm trying to say is, as you read more and more, your familiarity with the topics increases. Let's say you read something about Hitler and Holocaust and Nazis and anti-Jews. Now you come across an RC passage in which they are talking about eugenics. Okay? Eugenics ki baat chal rahi hai, Israel mein baat chal rahi hai, eugenics ki and how during the time of Hitler, eugenics was practiced in a different way. So you will be able to connect very easily. Why? Because you have already done a little bit of reading about Hitler, Holocaust, Nazis. Got it? So if there is familiarity, you will, re you will be able to read at a very great speed compared to somebody else who doesn't know what it is talking. So, you know, he gets totally kind of stumped over there and he just fumbles okay next one is three to five words at a time this works wonders for me three to five words when you're reading do not read every like don't pause at every word skim unnecessary portions na 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 the human eye has this capability to take in three to five words chunking that is what it is called so you know while you're reading Try reading this way. Take in three to five words together. Instead of dwelling on every single word as you read along. So that gives you speed. Try karke aap dekho. In the beginning it's going to be a little difficult for you. But slowly you will be able to grasp it. Then the penultimate point on this sheet is stop the inner monologue. That's again a hindrance. When beginners start reading, this is how they do. Read regularly, 200 words per minute. So, you know, that voice keeps going on. That is a major obstacle. You have to stop that. You have to read it in your mind. And once you start reading in your mind, for the first 20 days, you will face a lot of obstacles. You will find it difficult. But from the 21st day onwards, you will definitely be able to wrap your head around. And that brings me to the last point, peripheral vision. A peripheral vision is somehow connected to uh, three to five words at a time, that chunking thing that I said. So what is peripheral vision? Mm -hmm. I'm reading something which is there right in front of me, but my peripheral vision is the side. So while I'm reading this, somehow from the side, I can take in the other things also. It happens even while we are walking. Or if I'm sitting over here and I'm talking to you, my peripheral vision knows that there is a window, there's a door, there is nobody else in the room, there is a mirror. I know these things. Why? I'm not looking at those things directly, but my peripheral vision takes that all that in. Okay? So that is what I mean by peripheral vision. And when you're reading, you should start practicing these things. Don't stop. Don't pause at every single word. Don't read every single word. Take as a flow smooth and read from the right sources read the right kind of topics instead of just going to the hindu daily and reading the editorials there which are completely political you can give yourself a good mix 
just like a buffet you have a lot of things on a buffet similarly you can give yourself variety you can read the hindu the guardian new york times mint hindustan times uh, eon ideas you can read bloomsburg you can read scientific american smithsonian jstor these are these are just a few sources off the top of my head i have given a complete list of reading sources on my plus platform and of course in special classes also so read something that is relevant read the topics that you are likely to encounter on the d day to usse kya hoga familiarity badegi familiarity badegi speed badegi speed badegi obviously you will be able to skim through the passage in a very short period of time दो मिनट मैक्सिमम यू नो टू मिनट्स टू मिनट्स टू मिनट्स टेन सेकेंड्स एंड ऑल इसमें आपका पूरा पैसेज रीड हो जाना चाहिए आई होप माई पॉइंट हैव हैड सम काइंड ऑफ एन इम्पैक्ट ऑन योर अंडरस्टैंडिंग इन केस यू नीड फर्दर असिस्टेंट विद योर रीडिंग स्किल्स और मे बी यू वॉन्ट मी टू सिट विथ यू एंड गाइड यू विद अ पैसेज एज टू हाउ टू गो अबाउट द रीडिंग टेक्निक ज्वाइन मी इन माई प्लस क्लासेस गाइज और एटलीस्ट कम ओवर टू द स्पेशल क्लास find special class kya hote hain the free classes that we conduct uh it's on the unacademy app itself so like on tts tuesday thursday saturday i keep my special classes and i i keep doubt sessions every alternate day so like today i had one doubt session in the morning day after tomorrow i'll have two more doubt sessions okay so you are more more than welcome to just join me for that for those sessions and if you have doubts regarding your reading skills you can take them up that day with me i'll be more than happy to guide you with all that hope i have made sense today like share and subscribe if you just liked whatever i spoke and thank you so much i'm going to see you again bye bye guys